Hey, nerds! Well, this banner is about to end, the really good one, in case you haven't already. I, it ends in an hour, maybe an hour and a half, uh, since the time of recording. I'm gonna do this really quick, because, well, I need to. Uh, this one's actually being replaced, by the way, tonight, by a new banner that is focusing on combat boosts, which... Um, could be anything under the sun at this point. I really... I'm really not sure what that means, or what that entails, but... Okay, sure. Um... And technically, we also have this banner ending soon, and for those who don't know, usually, when it comes to ending banners like this, um, it means that we're going to be getting a new banner with newer characters, and the next banner should technically be revealed tomorrow, I believe? Uh, sec just because that's usually how it goes? I'm not too sure, because IS typically doesn't operate too much on weekends, but... I mean, stranger things have happened, I'm not too certain right now. They usually... Like, if they're going to reveal something, they usually have it air the Friday before the, you know, the, all of this goes on, or... Honestly, it's really anyone's guess at this point, but... Technically, we're going to be having a new trailer for new characters, and I'm really wondering what's going to be happening, because, uh... This is going to be the first time in probably a little while that we've had no seasonal banners, and I don't know how you guys feel about this, or how you feel about seasonal banners not being a part of things, um... I know a lot of you were start uh, were saving for Thracia, and therefore you got what you wanted, but, uh, I just, I'm not sure. Uh, <laughs> if anyone wants to answer that and just tell me what, what you want from the banner, or what you would hope for when it comes to characters, I'm always open, because on the 24th, well, we technically have a new banner with heroes, and who do you hope to get in? You know, things like that. But, it's a really, <laughs> I was honestly expecting them to release the trailer Friday, because usually they don't operate on weekends, as I've said before. But uh, this week is going to be really, really strange for for a lot of you, I'm sure. And I'm not sh cer so certain on what's going to be happening when it comes to the actual banners. But uh, usually, usually I can guess the patterns of IS pretty well. But unfortunately, I don't seem to be having that much luck. <laughs> They've kind of changed things a little bit around. But uh, still, nonetheless, here we are. And... I'm just, I'm not so certain on what's going to be happening. But, you know, we have a new banner. This one, of course, no seasonal, meaning that they're going to be added to the pool. And just simply tell me, guys, what do you want to see when it comes to this banner? What do you want to see? What are you hoping they'll add? Also, technically, the 24th of April, we're going to be going right into that as well with another banner. <laughs> just like a few, uh, I would say a week. In fact, I'm pretty sure that uh, technically falls on a Monday as well. And we're going to be having that pop up a little bit later this week, too. Or, well, next week. And it's going to be the next Legendary Hero, who I'm hoping, based on the timing, just so you know, uh, should be around, maybe, hopefully, uh, you know, the 1st of May. Uh, that, that We'll probably get the trailer before then. And, of course, I'm hoping it's going to be Marth, because technically it shares a lot of the timelines with a lot of things going on. Because it's, a, you know, the anniversary of Fire Emblem. And it would be kind of fitting to have Marth pop up. I don't know. This week is going to be an odd one. But I, I'm not even including the Bound Hero <laughs> Battle revivals and things like that. Because everything has been so sporadic and weird lately. <laughs> but I figured I would just mention this real quick. For those who were wondering, you do have a new banner coming up. Be ready. And you do have a legendary banner the week after that might include some really powerful units, including things like Halloween Jacob, uh, maybe Halloween Henry, maybe something, you know, else. There will probably be a performance arts dancer as well, because they've been tapering that out just a little bit. And I'm still, I don't think we've seen Inigo or we've seen uh, Sugar Ray either, so... Just put your bets down in the, in the comments below and we'll see what happens. For now, nerds, catch you later. Oh, boy. Not sure how I'm looking forward to next week, but hey... <laughs> we'll see what happens, guys.